is that sun shining in my eyes? I'm coming, I'm coming. So once I finally woke up, I went to grab my writing stuff and I went to the bathroom to brush my teeth and brush my hair and then I went to get breakfast. Then I went to Charles Bakery, which is where I usually have my breakfast at, and I ordered what I usually have. And actually along the way, I did actually meet one of my friends, so I said hi to her. Hi, I would like to order a few slices of banana bread and a glass of water. Okay ma'am, your total will be $9.57. Thank you very much. After I ate my breakfast, I went to the bus stop to take me to River Creek Stables, which by the way is my happiest place of the day. Hi, could I go to River Creek Stables please? Sure thing, just pop on the bus and you'll be right there in a second. Thank you very much sir. Once I got on the bus, we were off, and we went towards River Creek Stables. Once I arrived, I walked through the beautiful forest that was protecting the cross-country course, which I was going to try today. So then I went to grab Jess's tack, and then I went to grab her When I was grooming her, she got a little bit impatient because she always wants to just go, go, go. So it took a little bit to groom her, but eventually I got it done. And also, I swept the floor because that's a barn roll. Because there's going to be dirt when you hoof pick your horse's hooves and you just have to clean it up. Otherwise, it's just going to be gross. I actually put a mounting block in front of where I tied her because I'm short and it's kind of hard for me to untie her, so yeah. But after I tapped her up, I went to the arena to warm her up even though she was already mostly warmed up. I just didn't want her to be really stiff when we were jumping and then we went to do some cross country.